All right, Yenzers, what's up? So right here, we got a Colt MK4 Series 80 1911. Look how beautiful this thing is. I got it on loan with the Ruger. I was doing a buddy a favor and cleaning them up for him. And what a way to uh, end the 100th year of the 1911 by making a video on probably one of the best 1911s. This gun is absolutely beautiful. Now, he did do some modifications to it. He replaced the uh, spur hammer with a commander-style hammer. And he also put the extended beaver tail on. These did not originally come with the gun. And also here, he put a Wilson Combat fixed sight there. So, which really gives it a nice sight picture. I really, really like it. And I believe the grips that originally came with this were uh, wood grips. Now this comes in at 2 pounds, 6 ounces. So, just a beautiful, beautiful 1911. I believe it's the government model. 5 inch barrel, stainless. Uh, just a hood stainless on it though. The rest of it's blued. And I believe it's come out in probably 91. So this thing is 10, 15 years old. And he also put the magwell on there too as you can see. Absolutely beautiful gun. Really, really like the uh, bluing on it. It's almost purplish color. Absolutely gorgeous. Really, really nice. Has some wear and tear on it, as you would expect. But people I tend to hang out with shoot their guns. They don't really keep a lot of safe queens. We buy them, we shoot them, we clean them, we shoot them some more. The only thing is, is that he has the infamous idiot scratch, <laughs> which really sucks. So I was telling him, I don't know if he could send it back to Colt, if they would be uh, able to fix that, or if they'd have to re-blue the gun. But I'm going to make sure he goes home with one of these ISPT's idiot scratch prevention tool. I'll have the link down below for this. There it is right there if you just want to pause it. Excellent, excellent tool here. Seen this on the forums, and I also seen it on the 1911 channel, Mike's channel, which is now the 1911 channel. I seen it on the firearms channel. That's what it used to be. So, there you go, Mike. All fixed up. And, uh, we're gonna make sure my man gets one of them. Because this is a beautiful, beautiful 1911. The trigger on it, I believe he got some trigger work done to it because <laughs> it's just so crisp and right on. Now it could be cold or it just could be, but I believe he had some trigger work done because we have some modifications as I just told you about. Love the grips on it. Not sure if these are pack Myers, but they say cold all over them, so I don't know. Absolutely beautiful firearm. So, what a way to send out the 100 years of 1911 with a great Colt 1911 cleaned up with some rusty rags. That right there made that happen right there. That thing looks absolutely beautiful. I'm going to give it back to him in a pristine condition for sure. Great piece of American history right there. Absolutely love it. So for all you 1911 enthusiasts, now's the time to get one for sure. Because they're selling them like hotcakes. Everybody's making them. Beautiful, beautiful gun. Colt for the win. Alright, Yenzers. Have a positive day. Looking for me marbles. And I'm out.